Occasionally, when honeybees sting you, they will change their mind. What an awesome video, and believe it or not, rattlesnakes actually do something kind of similar. It turns out about a quarter of the time that they bite, you can get lucky and get what is called a dry bite, where they decide, hmm, now I'm just gonna bite and warn this thing to get away from me, because they don't actually want to waste their venom on us. Unlike bees that do have a stinger for defensive purposes, rattlesnakes have their fangs and venom for food acquisition purposes. And our pets, livestock, you, me, aren't food, so if a rattlesnake has time to think and kind of process what's going on, sometimes they will bite and not inject any venom because they just want you to leave them alone and they don't want to waste the venom on us. That being said, you absolutely need to go to the hospital if you get bit by a venomous snake or any snake you don't recognize so the doctors can make sure it was a dry bite for, for sure, for sure.